All right. Looking here, we're good. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to uh, Persona 3 Reload. I haven't streamed in, what, like three days? There's a reason for that. Um, some stuff is getting done. Uh, the bathroom's getting worked on. We had a leak in the room above me. And it kept... And it did a lot of damage. Because uh, it was leaking for a while. Um, so yeah. Things have been getting fixed. So yeah. Now it's the weekend. I should be fine. I'm going to stream for three hours today. Try to make up for some time. Maybe longer. We'll see how I feel. But um, yeah. It is currently almost 5 Central Standard Time. So yeah. Starting hour early. We'll see if we go to 8. Um, or probably try, I'll, I'll go to eight. Um, okay, yeah, you, I don't remember if we had other people to finish up, but Baluku Kulain right now. And we're going to be working on, yeah, we started Fuka, I like Priestess like I thought, Lover's Yukari, nice. We're going to continue with Yukari and Fuka when Yukari is not available, because if it's anything like the other Persona games, there should be like an extra step to their evolutions of Personas and stuff like that. But considering you can't actually like do anything with the guys so far, like Junpei was one of the first people like Yukari. I haven't been able to start his social link at all. We've had encounters with him and stuff like that. Same with Akihiko. That should, like, should have been a, um, thing, Majig. What, what, what am I thinking about? Should have been a start of the social link, but it never happened. Oh, wait, um, do I have lovers persona? I do. Nice. And just to be, just to double check, is Fuka? Fuka is not available. Okay, cool. I was worried that the, the those two would be have the same like schedule for some reason. What? Usually you see Koromaru. Kar okay, so it's another Koromaru thing. Sorry, but I got social links to finish. Um. Yeah, that's Koromaru right there. Still is the running dude. But yeah, my focus is gonna be on main party people. Yeah, party people. So, Yukari is starting. Um, yeah. Oh, Quacko. If you're headed to, or if you're heading out, do you want to stop by Polonia Mall together on the way back? Let's go home. I'll go closer soon. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, then let's go. I want to have a quick look. I want a quick little shot. Trip, wait. Quick, quick little shop trip first. That just sounds weird, and I, it tells me what today's gonna be like with me, and you know, not being able to differentiate words sometimes. Then check out the music store. Okay, we've got a lot of stuff to do. That was a really late start talking. Usually they start immediately, but that was like a little bit before you start. But anyway. Okay, so yeah. Be quiet. That's the normal timing for things. Those first two ones were really delayed for some reason. I was worried, but we're, we're back to normal, so everything's good. And sound level wise, I think. Hang on. Turn this up a little bit more. We'll do that. We're not in combat, so I think that's when things are loudest. Oh, 
How long was she gone? And does she do this often? Hey, don't cry. See, you're okay now. I'll stay here with you, alright? Hey, look. We can get help over there. Police station? Yep. Come on, follow me. The policeman will know what to do. He'll find your mom, so don't worry. Why are her the, these things so quiet? <sighs> what a relief. I'm glad he was able to contact the parents. What were they thinking leaving that poor kid all alone? Stuff like that really makes me upset. But I guess my own mom's no different. Yukari lore? Uh... What makes it say that? Why do you want to know? Okay, so then I won't ask. I didn't mean to poke fun at you. Remember what I told you before? How my mom and I aren't very close? Well, if you ask me what kind of parent she is, I'd say a terrible one. I see. She wasn't always like that, though. After what happened to Dad, she totally changed. She's probably living with one of her boyfriends somewhere. Oh. Honestly, I'd rather not know. Anyway, I'm done talking about this, okay? Uh, could we keep this between you and me? You're the only one I've told. Yukari has confided in me about her complicated relationship with her mom. It seems we've grown closer. <clears throat> I see. The guy in the background seems to need some help, but you know, I got other stuff to do. Sorry, I'm not in the mood for karaoke anymore. Let's Understandable. Parted with Kari and went back to the dorm. <laughs> I just realized I'm gonna have like nothing to do at night. Hey. By the way, how long have you been holding that she she to worry girl? I don't. Know. It's what's it's been like an in game gay or in game day. I feel like I said something different. Uh, about four days. I see. All right, good talk. <clears throat> Alright, so we have an Akamaru thing. We have the... I, I need to buy seeds, I need to remember that. And we have the Igus thing. Okay, well, what should we do here? Um, we never finished the Igus thing, I don't think. And that should be finishing up, right? Um, and then Akamaru. Did we? Wrong. Arasakunda. Us for watching the TV series, the documentary. Um, you don't have anything. I probably should finish you up then. You should be close, right? Okay. Um, let's see here. Lumina Pro, are you currently free for predetermined obligations? Free from predetermined obligations at the moment. I would like to enlist your assistance in absorbing all necessary information for the Yakuza novels. From the Yakuza, Yakuza novels. Serious. Get charm. Might gain a new ability soon. Uh, this is another matter I wish to discuss with you as well. Um, hang on. Understood. Let me check Arkham Lover's thing. <clears throat> Bark indeed. Uh, pet rush. Anticipation. Uh, I'm so sorry, sorry. Uh, bad timing. I want to. I really do. But we need to get, I guess, a special bonus and see what it is. Because we know what your special bonus is, and the next one should. His next bonus is probably the um, Masakunja, or whatever it is, where it goes to everybody. All the enemies get the. Uh, minus when he starts a fight. I think that's what that was. But we'll start, I guess, see what she gets, and then we'll focus on either. Um, and then I should check. 
hang on a second. Okay, so yeah, there is nobody here. All my stats are maxed. So, yeah. And let's read. Then I shall retrieve the book from my room. Please stand by until I return. Wait, what? Uh, I feel my charm. Okay. Already? We are talking? Not really need anymore, but yeah, see all those sixes. Charismatic genius badass. Um, I am going to upgrade my outer appearance. What? First, I will triple the current surface area of my armor plating. After that, what? I will repaint my body gold and add a large dragon to my back. <laughs> I tried to imagine that. Just the yoked out, um, I guess with a big dragon on the back. <laughs> um... What are you talking about? Not bad, I guess. Sounds tacky. Yes, it sounds extremely tacky. That is not true. Yes, it is. You actually see my upgraded form. I suspect your socks will explode, as they say. Outer appearances carry an influence that is beyond my ability to calculate. The main character of this story also carefully cultivated his image so everyone would take him seriously. That is why I'm looking into upgrading myself. In order for me to become more dependable, it's necessary I change my appearance. Don't you agree? No. Yeah, what's upon it is attitude. You're not dependable based on how you look. So people, but people will have a first impression if you look like you're supposed to be there. But dependable is how you've been, you know, being dependable. That idea. Attitude. So that's what takes priority. Oh, could it be? I apologize. Please forget what I said about upgrading my appearance. Oh, I don't think she got it. I had the completely wrong idea. Okay, well. At one point, the main character of the book says, Can't have people think I ain't cool. Until then, he'd put so much effort into his attire, yet he goes to raid his rival's territory wearing nothing but a shimekomi. Uh. Thanks to you, I finally understand what's most important in life having a strong heart to stay true to your beliefs okay i, I was honestly I, I know this is a thing where they usually have some good message at the end of it i was half expecting her to say that she needs to wear the what was it called the sakuchi kuchi um uh shimakomi shimakomi i'm assuming that's like the it's eq's of a thing so it's either like the bands wrapped around the stomach and or where it's just the the long cloth type deal thing. Something like that. Therefore, I will also follow what I believe in. I may not appear dependable, but don't worry. I will adjust my attitude to reach maximum energy output and to increase my ammo stocks by 50%. <laughs> You don't have ammo. I, you just go. But all right, fifty percent of infinite is you know still infinite. By understanding the essence of the story, I guess is feeling her fighting spirit. So what do you get? Talk about guns, so it should be good, right? Uh, physical boost strengthens physical skills. That's actually really good, considering how much damage she was doing before. She's gonna be doing even more damage now. For some reason, I feel like going to Tartarus and raising some hell. Uh, some other time. See, I think the boost is like twenty-five percent, right? Amp is like fifty percent, and then there's something that's like seventy-five percent that they added in this game. Shall we conduct a raid? No. And so late. It doesn't seem like we'll be able to go tonight. How unfortunate. 
I'll just return to my room then. Okay. Attention, please. All right. Let's take a look at some English idioms. Idioms. I said idioms. Idioms. When someone has a big mouth, it means they're a loud mouth or a boastful person. Yep. There's also the phrase, spill the beans. We're about I guess in this class. What exactly does this idiom mean? Junpei, why don't you answer? Uh, me? Hey, Lunaro, do you know what it means to spill the beans? Uh, to reveal a secret. That's a pretty well-known one. Yeah, nobody got that one off. Yes, that's correct. There are many theories about why the word beans is used. One particular particularly famous theory says that beans were used to vote in ancient Greece. At the, that time, they put white beans for yes and black beans for no into the ballot box. And if you spilled the beans before voting, it revealed their color in your once secret vote. Oh, that, that reminds me. Last time, my darling. Oh, she's talking to someone else. I was, I was, I was confused there for a second. Oh, thanks, Luminifero. I forgot. It. I keep forgetting, like, Luminifero is because I couldn't put, put the full name in there. That gun gave him the answer just now. He must be really smart. Yeah, yeah, I'm super popular and smart. After all, I am a, a genius and charismatic, as well as a badass. Me by my name. I wasn't sure if you'd ever say it again. I mean, at least Junpei is like getting back to his old self there. That's a good thing. Well, he's probably pretending to be his old self. But that, that's also a possibility. <laughs> mm hmm. Grunt a little. Mm hmm. Any luck? She finally started talking. But she hasn't said anything useful so far. Well, I want to start. More of a response than we got from her. I'm just putting this out here, out there. Um, maybe she'll be more willing to talk with Junpei by himself. You know, you could give him a voice recorder or something, and just, or just sit out the and the, out of the room. Maybe just rely on Junpei to say what she says. There's a lot of things you could be doing rather than having you know all of her. A bunch of people she's, that are probably making her uncomfortable, <laughs> sitting like right there. That's not how interrogations go, <laughs> or I should say, counseling in this case. No, I shouldn't say counseling. That's that's kind of a bad light on counseling right there. I, I shouldn't say it like that. But yeah, interrogation. No, we'll just keep it at that. So. Are you here? <laughs> Shidori, what's wrong? Uh. Uh. What is that? There's something right there. An enemy. Is that her persona? Persona just went berserk. It happens. It happens? Am I missing something here? I don't think that's ever happened in any other situation here. It happens. 
Okay, good. I'm not the same one. I'm not, not the only one who's confused here. Weren't you guys watching? You could see her persona strangling her for a second. They're not like us. They can't fully control their personas. Okay. Like he said, us. That's why they need to take suppressants. To keep their personas from killing them. I don't remember hearing something. I'll, I'll wait. Suppressants? Wait. Do you know something about Strega? <clears throat> Some things you only pick up stepping off the straight and narrow. Yeah, he was getting suppressants from Strega. I'll give the duck the meds I have. The rest is up to you. Don't you need those? Shinji, wait! Hey! So now they all leave. She's probably gonna say something important now. Death is nothing to be afraid of. Well, I mean, not what I meant by important, but okay. What are you talking about? Dying just means you won't wake up tomorrow. That's all. Mm -hmm. What the hell are you saying? You don't really mean that, do you? Junpei. I don't want that. You hear me, Chidori? I don't want you to die. Junpei. It doesn't matter if you're not afraid. That's not the point. I don't want to have to live in a world without you. All right, Junpei's escalated really quickly with how he feels about her. <laughs> you're so weird, Junpei. <laughs> Look who's talking. But he's getting to her. Hey, wait! Shinji! And based on how she's acting, I'm assuming that she's he's probably one of the first people to actually say something like that to her, so. Good on him. What the hell's going on? Why did you have those suppressants? I've heard about what they do. They're taken to rein in a persona when the user can't control it. Green text? Have I ever used green text before? I don't think I remember hearing that. There's like red text for like specific things, but it's just like exposition text. But the side effects. Do they make you grow hair on your eyes? You're not taking them, are you? Answer me! I think he did answer. I don't have to tell you shit. Why are you always like this? Save it. I've heard it all before. You think I'm wasting my power. You can't stand the sight of someone so half-assed, right? I'm sick of your damn preaching. And the left? Shit. You don't understand at all. I mean, yeah, a left straight from uh, someone who's like, what, top boxer in this area, state, whatever he is, that, that's gonna hurt. You should already know, ten years ago, when the orphanage burned down, I couldn't save my sister back then. I wasn't strong enough to get past the adults holding me back to even try. <sighs> That's why I try so hard. I thought you felt the same way. We promised each other to become strong enough to do what we think is right. So why? Why'd you start taking those drugs without telling me? I'm back in the fight now. I have no reason to suppress my persona anymore. Okay, so they're used as presents to express the persona you don't need when you're using it? Okay. 
So yeah, this is what I think that he needed those drums. So he's also like them where his persona will go crazy if he isn't like fighting or something. Interesting. Also, I'm going to turn this up just a little more. Just a little more. I, I don't know how it actually sounds, but... So just let it go. Damn it. And the side effects. There's something I need to take care of. It's something only I can do. I gotta take responsibility. What do you mean? Listen. Quit worrying about me. Just do what you think is right. Got that? Shinji. Mm-hmm. 